Hi guys, it's your boy Chris here from Heed the Ball Gaming. Welcome back to episode 4 of that Football Manager 2019 save where we give Falkirk £1 billion. Just give him it, there we go. Make up from getting relegated. There's no way a team of Falkirk's size should be getting relegated. It's just been bad management from the, the board and the chairwoman. And they did away with the youth academy. They've paid a lot of decent players off and brought in guys that weren't quite up to it so yeah we gave him a billion pound just to make up for it but the only thing is I'm not allowed to spend it that responsibility falls to our director of football Dario Ferrari the Italian stallion as I call him he is the worst director of football in history he's a judging player ability of one he is judging player potential of one he doesn't know anybody in Scotland he doesn't care he's He's just here for a good time. He's not here for a long time, just a good time. So, yeah, he's in charge of everything and, and he's not making a very good job at the moment. So, we're here on deadline day. And if I just go to the inbox, I have agreed to take, take part. So, we're just going to keep skipping forward and see if Dario Ferrari's actually going to do anything. Transfer so far, he's not... He keeps scouting players and saying, recommending them, but I don't know if I'm allowed to say yes, no. So, I've just been saying, acknowledging it, I've not been doing anything else, so we'll see how, how it goes. Look for transfer history, he's made three signings, Lionel Ainsworth from uh, Falkirk, and he also brought in Elliot Christie from Partick Thistle, he likes Partick Thistle, so I'd imagine a few Partick Thistle players are going to be coming in, Niall, Cowan, uh, Niall, Niall Keown, sorry, and Martin Keown's son, and Scott Mercer from Queen of Safe. And I quite like him. He looks decent. So what I'm looking for is some more players. And let's see if what he does. We're just going to keep going forward and seeing if he actually makes any offers for anybody. It's Katie. Ferrari makes an offer for what? Oh, do I look at him? No. Oh, he's spending big. He's spending big. He's going for 3.7 million. <laughs> it's the amount for... Anyway, I, I'm not going to look at him, but we'll look at him together when he, when he looks at it. This game is so fast compared to um, the Tasmania Bell Lynch. Oh, we've accepted it. Wolves have accepted it. Right. There's a few players that have... He, he doesn't want to pay the wages. He's happy to pay the transfer budgets, but that, he, he's, he's blown it there. Oof. Oh, he signed. He signed. Right. He's only three stars. What is that all about? <laughs> oh, I think he's overpaid there. <laughs> he's good, but he's, he's Scottish, oh. He's Scottish. Right, okay. Okay, I'll, I'll... Yeah. He's got potential, and he, he definitely looks good. Determin oh, determination of free for a young player. He just can't have that. Right, okay, okay, that's fine. Right. I don't want to discuss it. Go away. Talk to Dario. 3.5 million for a player of that right. Oh, he's gone again. He's gone again. He's gone for Josh Edwards from Airdrie. And he's... It's a lot smaller. It's only 10 grand. And they've accepted it. Oh, this is exciting. This is like Christmas. <laughs> I just don't know what I'm getting. Could be socks. Could be an iPad, we don't know. <laughs> Could be a weird looking tie. What is smart business? Well, that's good news. He's smart business, I like that. McCall is saying that. So, if it's good enough for Ian McCall, it's good enough for me. Just checking I'm recording. Not saying that. Oh, it's a wee gap in the. In the is that the right way? Yeah, we gap in the oh big gap. There we go in the green screen. So what's going on? Oh, I'm scared to look. Oh, he's signing. Oh, and Josh Edwards has signed, and he's a two-star player. This is not good. Right, ask McGee to welcome him. We we don't know what he looks like. Let's have a look. Oh, he's not bad. Determination a nine, a little bit better. Eighteen year old, he likes the kids. Yeah, but yeah, 
I'll accept him. You'll go right into the youth team. Will he do any more business? He's, he started strongly. There must be somebody else coming in. No, nothing. Right, let's click again. Come on. Let's see who else you can bring in, mate. No, no one. Right, let's click ahead. Still waiting. Yeah, 3.5 million. That took me by surprise. <laughs> he has the ability to overpay. So, oh. I'll just give that to the Only two hours remaining. He's not going to do any more business, is he? No, he's not. Let's praise Jordan McGee. Oh, I'm disappointed. I thought we'd do a little bit more, more business. That's it. Oh well. Yeah. Okay. Right, he signed. <laughs> he smashed the record. Quarter of a million was the last time. It was Derek Ferguson from Sunderland, and now he's smashed it. Three point seven million from Elliot Watt, and yeah, he's. He could be a star, but he's yeah, he's a long way away from it. <laughs> it wasn't what we needed. I wanted a striker. <laughs> oh well, there we go. That's one of the things, right? I'll fast forward to the Ross County game. Right, so we're back for the Ross County game. Just mixing things up a wee bit. Going for Mitchell and goal, Mercer, McGee, Edge and Bro, and then McKee, Osman and McShane, and Ainsworth. Elliot and Rudden. I'll go through the squad and everything the next episode once I know who's going to be my first team, who's going to be reserves and just try and figure out what, what I've got actually because I was kind of waiting. I thought Dario Ferrari would go a little bit nuts. He has. He's went a little bit nuts but not in the way I wanted. I wanted a... Yeah. I'll give him 13. He's a record signing. 13 is a good goalkeeper's number, not a midfielder's but we'll see how he goes. So yeah, he has went nuts. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm disappointed, but there's always a January transfer window. And the good news is the border over the moon with my control of the finances. Well, considering we've got a billion in the bank. <laughs> See that, right? I'm actually quite enjoying this. It's, I haven't had enough time to get into this. Um as much as I like, just because I work and stuff, but if I can get a run and make a few of these videos, then you'll hopefully get them every second day. It's just, um, just with work in the Tasmania, Berlin save, it's um, quite difficult to try and fit it all in. And I've been trying a couple of experiments as well, so the Messi and Ronaldo one was fun at um, Berwick Rangers. And the Albion Rovers, respectively, and then I put the whole, oh, good, the whole um, France 2018 World Cup winners in the Premier League. Just put them all in Huddersfield and then seeing if he could win the, the Premier League. So, oh, that was, looked like that was a miss hit, but that was a lovely pass. Yeah, and just seeing if, if Huddersfield could win the Premier League with all the French World Cup winning squads and Didier Deschamps as manager. And, oh, you have been doing with a couple of defenders, to be honest. <laughs> McGee and Edge are not as good as I thought. As I say, I think I'll, once I see what I've got, I'll um, sit down. I don't think I'm in any danger of getting sacked just yet, so we'll, um, we'll see how it goes. But yeah, 3.5 million are expected. A proper good player. Oh, there we go, Osman. And he didn't get sent off running over the top and oh, none of the strikers have it. I, oh, Fox. Ross County are obviously are the champions, so they're a good side. And they're definitely going to make the Premier League stronger this year. Well, the incoming year. Dundee just didn't have anything about them this year, so. Oh, Ainsworth! Was that offside? It wasn't. He's an inspired sign in Ainsworth. I was always a big fan of him at Motherwell. Yeah, yeah, we're definitely going to make the Premier League a lot stronger um, in Scotland. So, yeah, we're a good side that know what we're doing. So, it'll be interesting to see who 
what happens when you play off the final game this um, <laughs> this Saturday. So we've got Hamilton and St Mirren going for it. Obviously Hamilton have got the extra point, so it's in their hands. Oh, Mercer. Rodden off the post. This, is, this team has been exceedingly unlucky. Yeah, so it's... It's a fair enough. I was kind of a bit worried that Ferrari wouldn't do any business, but he's delivered some excitement at least. And that's the fun, he's so, so bad that it's just like when the board accept a transfer without you knowing if he's, he's in charge, that I have no say, so I, I can't get too attached to any of the players. Mercer, and another cross, he's looking good. Oh, penalty! Get him off, off, off. No. Andy Boyle. And McKee with a penalty. Oh, what a penalty. And we've come from one behind. That has been a absolutely amazing performance so far. Completely out of character for this side, but oh, what am I doing? Oh, I press the wrong button. It's the excitement of that transfer window. <laughs> if you watch the Tasmania Berlin save, there's a a major player down in the middle of a transfer battle with as well. The board have accepted so. But it's, it's definitely worth more than what we've accepted. But it's real life. That's what we do. Comes in financial trouble. They pay the wages to the end of the year. So you can't get too annoyed at it. You do, but you can't. Mackay. Oh. There we go. You can do that all the time. Right, let's demand more. Oh, we're pressurised by it. This, this team are not... I'm not the team I expected. I know how Tasmania Berlin react when I shout. I don't know. I haven't had much chance to play about with any other teams, really. So, this is an interesting experiment. So, yeah, if you're enjoying this and want to see what Dario Ferrari is up to, hit that subscribe button. Right, pause. We're going to go to the Tasmania Berlin defensive. Oh, I like that. Um, Callum Elliott. Christy Elliott, even. That's going to be confusing. Two Elliots. Christy Elliott, Elliott Wall. Oh, that's even worse. <laughs> um, where are we going? What are we doing? Are we bringing a defender on? Todorov. Or Kieran McKenna. It's not telling me who's best. Told her off it is then. <laughs> no. For Ainsworth. And then Ain oh no, that's not good. Undo. Undo. Right, undo it. Right. So let's start again. This is sorry, this is interesting view here. So so what Ainsworth off for McKenna. You see that's confusing because Toda Ross a striker, isn't he? So he's coming on anyway, so Ainsworth's coming off for McKenna and then Toda Ross coming on for Elliot and then we're going to see the new man, Elliot Watt. Sounds like a university, doesn't he? Elliot Watt. <laughs> sorry, Hel Elliot Watt. Sorry. <laughs> right, play. We're going to the defensive. We're going to see if we can hold on to this. And we're not, are we? Because they don't know it. <sighs> this is going to be a mistake. Yes, it's a mistake. <sighs> Did the changes even take effect there? This is the Drawmaster General team. 
Just so many draws. At least I'm not getting beat, I suppose, but I should have kept on them. I'm annoyed at that. As I say, once, once we, it was just a few one out process. Once I figure out my best team, McShane, Kelly, Fontaine, and that's it. Right, team talk. Unlucky boys. I think we played reasonably well. I think we were just unlucky. Yeah, third bottom, but we're. Yeah, I think we're too good. We're, we played four. We've drawn three of them, so we're not. We're not terrible. Um, just in terms of the competitions, what the so your schedule. I think what I'm going to do is we've got the Hearts reserves in the Iron Brew Cup. We'll probably hammer through that one because we beat St Johnson reserves on penalties. So, Air United, Dundee United, Dundee United are a big team. I quite like to show you that hour. I think what I'll do is I'll just play three or four games, see how we're sitting, and come back maybe about Morton, Queen of the South, and Ross County again, and see how we go. All right. Because I'm, I'm aware now we've played four episodes of this and we haven't moved on, so we'll see how we go. Okay, thanks very much for watching. If you like my stuff, check out my channel and see if there's any other stuff you like. Subscribe, and I'll catch you the next time. Thanks very much.